What's up guys, how are you guys doing today? So you guys probably see this little mark on my neck. I actually just shaved and for some reason, whenever I shave, that little Adam's apple part right here, I always like cut it. I don't know exactly how to not do it. I've tried so many times to like carefully go over that and I somehow still end up cutting this little part. So I just ate breakfast, I didn't vlog it. I always vlog my food, but um, I ate uh, literally one turkey burger patty and I'm still hungry as shit. I'm trying to cut down really hard on these calories. It's like I'm almost starving myself, but not really. I'm just taking in a lot less calories than I usually do. But I mean, this is what I gotta do. <laughs> oh, I should be used to your shit by now. I know. Grandma's the easiest person to scare. You're like the perfect target for pranks, Grandma. Yeah, right. So what are you doing? Watching TV? Yeah, just relax before we go to Walgreens. You know, let's just go now then. We're gonna go to Walgreens for Grandma. She's gonna grab some stuff. And then, you know what we should do today? We should do that makeup challenge video because everyone's asking for it. Oh, uh, really? Yeah, so you guys will see me do Grandma's makeup. I'm, I'm gonna make you fun. look beautiful, Grandma. Oh, gee. <laughs> Psych. Like there's any improvement to be made here, you could do it. <laughs> Alright, Graham, so what do you want? The scooter or the hoverboard? What are you gonna ride? I'm gonna take both. You're gonna take both? Damn, yeah. Graham's a champion. I'm not taking anything, I'm kidding. Because I gotta walk with Graham, she's a slow walker. My door's getting worked on right now because the thing wasn't locking correctly. I'm not sure exactly what was wrong with it. It was like off balance with the door. So they're gonna fix that right now. Ah! ah! You knew, didn't you? Yes, I did. Because I walked so fast ahead. She suspected something. Grom, sit down on this bench. No, seriously, sit. try it. No, I'm not. No, it's heated. I'm sorry. It's a heated bench. Try it. It's, it's crazy. Is Your ass is hot enough? <laughs> Damn, Grandma, you pulling. No, seriously, like, it's heated. It's weird. Feel it. Oh, yeah. Ain't that crazy? Grom, I swear, I feel like there's going to be not a single day while we're out here that we got to go to Walgreens for something. Am I wrong? Probably not. I feel like every day we're probably gonna end up going there for something. So I really need to get a multivitamin, so I'm looking at these right here. And here's the stupid thing. This is an off-brand. This is the Walgreens brand, and this is the one a day. And this one's a lot more expensive, and it has literally all the same exact stats on the back. Like, I checked on this one. They're all exactly the same. You're pretty much just paying for the brand name at that point, so I'm just gonna go with the cheaper one because why not? So what happened? He said he had failed, so I said, well, what I'm done. For the medicine? Yeah, I said, what I'm done doing, I gotta do, I'll stop back just in case it's done. If not, I'm like, we're gonna come back later. Yeah, I'll pick it up later today. What are you looking at? I need to give me a pile of shoes. Oh, okay. I'm also gonna purchase some fish oil because my joints lock up sometimes when I'm lifting, so this will help out with that. So I'm getting fish oil and multivitamins. That should be good. You ready, Grom? Let's it's head not, out. It's not ready, I doubt it. It's not. Go Sounds good, and I'll come back later and pick it up. You guys don't realize how hard it is for me to look at all these candies right now and not cave in. It is killing me. Got everything we need. Of course, Graham's got to smoke her cigarette. Oh my god, that smells so fucking bad. I hate the smell of cigs. It's not pleasant at all. Don't blow it in my face. We had to take a little break because Graham's got back pain. She can't walk far distances. That's why in the airport, we had to put her in a wheelchair because she can't walk all the way through that airport. I mean, it's not like the cigarettes are helping her lungs and her breathing anyway. So that's probably another reason why we gotta sit here. My not lungs only are your fine. Bed. My lungs are fine. Surprisingly. They're probably black as shit. How long? I don't really smoke a lot. When did you start smoking, Grom? What age? 16. 16 years old, Grandmom started smoking. Don't smoke, guys. It's bad no, for your health. No, don't smoke. It costs too much money. Hey, Grom said don't smoke because it costs too much money. You don't even give a shit about the health. She's talking about the money. Cigarettes have been around a long time. Oh, yeah. That's one thing that I cannot stand is secondhand smoke. I have a lot of friends who smoke cigarettes and smoke weed. And with both instances, like, I try and cover my nose as much as possible or move to a different area so I don't have to smell that stuff. They're working on the gym area right now. Just got back and I'm going to take these gummies. See how they taste? They're, they should taste fine. Even if they taste terrible, I would just swallow them whole. Like, I don't really care. I just had the gummies and they taste fine. I mean, how do you fuck up gummies, honestly? I also take this stuff called L-carnitine every single day. You basically just pour it onto a tablespoon and take it. But this helps with your energy levels and cognitive function. My arms are so sore right now from yesterday. But here's the thing. When I'm sore, I don't bitch about being sore. I actually love 
the feeling of being sore because I know that I've done something that's working towards progress. You know that saying, no pain, no gain? Well, it's not always hypothetically correct because you can still grow even if you don't feel a soreness, but I love the feeling of being sore. It just makes my mindset feel like I'm actually doing something and working towards something. All right, guys, so I was thinking about this because one of my friends brought it up to me yesterday. So we don't have a nickname for you guys. Like, everybody's got a nickname. For example, uh, Roman's got Roman Soldiers. Fousey Tube's got, what is that, I think it's Bra Bras. Prank vs. Prank is Dope Fresh Nation, but I don't got shit. I don't know what we can call ourselves, guys. So you guys gotta leave me a comment down below and leave me some suggestions. Somebody said the Lancers before, but I don't really like that. I don't know, I just feel like I gotta brand you guys with a name so you guys feel like a whole family. So I can notify you guys as that one thing and you guys will always stick with that. I don't know, I think it would be pretty cool. But I'm just stumped right now because I don't know what the name could possibly be. That's why you guys are gonna help me out. Grandmom said the two tenors. I don't know about that. Oh, oh my gosh, I just thought of something fucking great. Hold on. Okay, guys, think about this. And I feel like this is almost disrespectful, but not at the same time. What if we called people the motherfuckers? <laughs> <laughs> What's up, you crazy motherfuckers? How you guys doing today? That would be a funny intro. If I change my intro to like, hey, what's up guys, how you guys doing today? Be like, hey, what's up you crazy motherfuckers, how you guys doing today? Yeah. Wouldn't that be funny? Yeah, it's funny, but I don't think it's a good idea. I don't know either, because I feel like people would click off the video as soon as they hear that. Yeah. They'd be like, oh, this person curses right off the bat of his right. videos, every yeah. single video. It's a bad idea. You motherfuckers. I mean, it sounds good, out. <laughs> that is funny. If you guys like that, let me know. But otherwise, you guys leave me comments of what you think. Uh, we should call each other. Cody, I'm on FaceTime with Cody. He just told me that he hasn't showered since the day he was with me. You Bullshit. fucking dirtball. Bullshit. You Never fucking dirt. Look, he's hiding right now. He doesn't want to show it. <laughs> so I bought this pesto yesterday, and at first when I read it, I said, oh my gosh, this is only 200 calories, and I bought it, and I'm so stupid, I didn't look at the serving size. I usually do look at the serving size, but this time I just didn't for some reason. And there's three servings in here, which means this is 660 calories. That's a lot of fucking calories, man. I just don't feel like eating this right now, so I'm gonna go down to Trader Joe's again and get something else that's a little bit less calories and maybe a little more filling. I also just got a brand new modem today because my last modem was fucking terrible. Like, the internet kept cutting out. I couldn't even upload my videos through this. I was having to use my phone some days. I had to create a hotspot on my phone some days to even upload my vlogs. So we got this finally fixed and this seems to be working good. Graham's gonna come with me. We're gonna go down to Trader Joe's and grab some food because uh, I'm starving. I already ate like 180 calories today, which is absolutely nothing. Eat some food, get my day started. I think Cody and Russell are gonna come by later today, so that should be fun and entertaining for you guys. You guys probably noticed that whenever I'm hanging around my friends, my vlogs are always so much longer and so much funnier and just better overall. When I'm sitting inside an apartment by myself, bored the entire day, obviously I'm not gonna get that great footage for you guys. That's another reason why I love being home in New Jersey because I have the whole family setting and I have a lot of people to interact with and show you guys on the videos. Because when I'm home, obviously my girlfriend's a lot of this stuff, grandmom's always in it, my mom, my dad, and Sabrina, and it's just like a whole family fun process, I guess I should say. It's so much more entertaining, that's why I love it so much. And of course, I just love being around my family. I just can't wait to go in this store and have that dude stare me down because well, I'm holding a camera in my hand. I'm not gonna use it, but this dude just stares me down for no reason. It happens every time. He just literally like, he'll see me with my camera in my hand because I hold it everywhere I go and he'll just be eyeballing me the entire time while I'm walking throughout the store. So this was really good, the lemon pepper chicken that I got the other day, but the part where I fucked up was I got bread with it. I'm just gonna eat the chicken by itself and not with bread. So I just realized this, there's 400 calories in that chicken. And if I was to eat two meat patties of the turkey burger, that's 360 calories, and I'd be getting a lot less protein, and I get way more out of eating this entire chicken than I would with the turkey burger. So I think I'm just gonna do that from now on. It makes so much more sense. I'll get way more full off the chicken and have a lot more protein in it than I would be with the turkey burgers. Oh, I just fell in love with that chicken. That chicken was so good, and I'm finally feeling good right now. I don't feel full, which is great. I just feel satisfied. That's all I wanna feel. I don't wanna feel that full feeling anymore. Because obviously, if I get that feeling, I most likely overate. But I'm headed downstairs right now because Cody is outside. He wants me to go to the store for really quick, and then I guess we'll come back here and chill. Where are you at? I'm pulling up right now. I'm at the red light. Okay. Yo, yo, yo. What, what up? up? You gotta unlock it. Watch my door on the sidewalk. Yeah, I know these sidewalks are so fucking high. I mean, 
Gotta slam my door too, shit. <laughs> Beep. <laughs> He's looking still. Holy shit. Look at all that smoke. Alright, I found your section. Woman's world? Yeah. Let's go. Nah, I need tries on a bra. Fat and tall. Fat and tall. It's like they actually have an aisle named that. Fat and tall. Damn, dude, you see the new Jordans? Hey. <laughs> Yo, holy shit. Whose feet are this big? Here's my shoe next to one of these shoes. Yeah, but you also Damn. wear a size five. No, I wear eight and a half nines. What do you wear? Twelves. Look, they're fucking huge. They're still bigger than yours. Well, that was a waste of time coming here, because he's not even getting anything. They don't have anything here. Yeah. Well, actually, they have plenty of stuff here, just none of it fits him. <laughs> Good one. I mean, I'm not lying. Well, sorry that I don't fit into a small like you. Like a fucking, you're like a little prepubescent teenager. I actually wear medium shirts, so. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> oh, that's funny. They all waved. I was trying to scare them, but they just waved back. This guy was holding it in his horn. I just fucking went. Of course, as soon as Cody gets here, he's gonna eat. <laughs> he left this shit here the other day, and I told him to come back and eat it. Taking out the scooter. This floor is so uneven. If you guys hear it rumbling, it's because it's not even at all. Fuck off. Hey. Be a hot trap song. <laughs> Why is there a random fruit out here? Oh, oh! I just ran it over. <laughs> and this is exactly why I like Xbox over PS4 because. It takes fucking forever to download something. It's saying this is gonna take 15 hours to download when if this was Xbox, it would take like ha a half hour. So I'm at Press Juicery right now. I'm getting a Freezy. It's, it's kind of like frozen yogurt, except it's the healthy version of it. And even with the toppings, it's gonna be under 100 calories. So it's gonna be pretty good. Awesome, thank you. Oh, that looks great. This looks so good and it's healthy too. This is basically pressed juice but frozen. It's vanilla almond and I got almonds as a topping, almond butter, and some strawberries. Repeat that. I was just going down this hill doing 43 miles an hour on this That's scooter. what it showed? Oh my yeah, god. 43 miles an hour. And you said the scooter shut off because you were going so quick? Yeah. Holy Dude, shit. I started pushing on my brakes like at that orange sign and it took me until right here. And you couldn't slow even down. slow down. Yeah. <laughs> oh damn, what happened here? Someone's just getting put into the ambulance. What a great place to put a key. Just stick some fucking gum to it and put it on concrete and you're good. No one's gonna take it. This stuff is actually really good. So if I'm ever like really craving a snack, I'll just get this instead because it's super low calories. Okay, so we just found out what happened right here. Cody, explain. So there was a guy and he was like uh, riding a skateboard and he went to grind down like a four set of stairs and he fell off his board and smashed right into this silver car right here. He like broke his leg. Holy shit. Yeah. Damn, and that's the cars crazy. were like all driving by and shit. Like I was talking to one of the guys, he's like, I think he's a fucking idiot for doing it while cars are driving by. Yeah, right? Like he could have got ran over and shit. Holy shit. We're riding right now to go to Best Buy because Russell needs an Ethernet cord. Sit in it. <laughs> Here we go again. <laughs> There's gotta be a way we can make this work. Yo, chill. Damn, someone's getting towed. <laughs> oh, it's all that pollen. This is tree bar from a palm tree. These things fall all over LA. They're huge. Oh, man, go off, go off, go off. <laughs> oh, what is this place? It's like a little sensei garden. A little shop? <laughs> Are you gonna jump off? So I don't know if you guys
guys remember my old vlogs where we would go in restaurants and scream at the top of our lungs? It's the funniest shit. Everybody gets real quiet and it just looks at you. So we're gonna go on in and out Burger right now and do that. These board rides were literally the highlight of all of my vlogs like a month and a half ago. Like we would do the most savage fucking shit. Yeah, we need Chris out here, dude. One of you has to ride the hoverboard down all these stairs. Fuck no. Russell's gonna do it if he uses mine. All right, do it. Go. I'm not busting my fucking ass. You're failing so hard. In and out burger. Okay. Wow! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Look at this kid. Oh. <laughs> that wasn't really that great. It kind of sucked, honestly. <laughs> Everyone still shut up though. Yeah. One of the nights that we rode these boards, we literally went over five miles on these things, and every single one of our boards died, and we had to take an Uber back to my place. Burnouts. Holy shit. <laughs> this McDonald's is hooked the fuck up. That's like, that's like a riffraff McDonald's. <laughs> a riffraff McDonald's. No, for real, this thing's pimped out. Got your cord, leg out. Dude, this guy's got like blades on the back of his fucking car. That is insane. All right, go. Kobe. Fails. So we didn't make it. Russell's board died, so now we get an Uber. This is not gonna work, dude. dude With all of Cody's weight and you, yeah, fuck no. no. You're gonna fuck. break the thing. Yo, that's a total of like 700 pounds right there. All right, so we just ran into a guy that has this new hoverboard type of thing. Holy crap! So this thing moves on its own. Do I just stand on it? Same thing. Uh, you drive it like that, pick it up, or you just operate it like normal. Oh wow! It's essentially a hoverboard, but this is your how you steer. What the hell? Let me try it out. Yeah. So it doesn't control, it's only controlled by your knees. Oh, so it's yeah, controlled so by my knees right here. How fast does it go? Oh, this is tricky. Can you go backwards on it though? This is, yeah, you can. This is tricky. It's like, whoa. <laughs> backwards and turning is not. It's, it's, it's not that, like, it's definitely gonna take time to get used to compared to those boards. But. Literally just lean. Yeah. So he's driving it right now with the app. So we just happened to be riding by this dude and he asked me if I want to try out the board. And he said that was a Segway board and basically it's Segway's version of those little hoverboards that we ride all the time. It's kind of hard to control at first, but I'll probably get used to it just like I did to this board. Cause this was hard to ride at first for me too. Yo, this lady straight up looks like a clown. <laughs> just got out of the Uber. Getting her stuff out the back. Got a fucking videotape everything. Yep. So we just came back. How much time we got? Four hours <laughs> left. Four hours left. Are you serious, PlayStation? Oh my god, this thing sucks. You wanna go outside? This is how Cody talks to his dogs. Ricky, you wanna go outside? Daddy's home. Daddy's home. Me, I'm daddy. Oh god. <laughs> what are you, you were sleeping? Yeah, I the Alright, night. Oh, I just stubbed the back of my fucking foot on that. Oh, it's all scraped up now. So we're inside right now, about to go down by the pool, and Russell's like, fuck it, I'm just gonna piss in the pool. Dude, I literally have a bathroom right fucking here. Go there. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's grandma's room. I'll go to the bathroom. Can you record me going piss again? Yeah. You fucker, get out of here. <laughs> What's <laughs> <laughs> blue shit. Uh, I don't know. He had to stop pissing super quick. I bet he got <laughs> piss on his swim trunk. You wanna check him? Yeah. Come Turn here. around. He stopped, he stopped pissing so fast he didn't even shake it. Yeah, he literally yeah. just pulled his pants off real fucking quick. I heard quick. and I was literally just shaking like right as I was about to go. <laughs> you guys are gonna see Cody Cannonball into the hot tub. All, All the water. All the water is gonna disappear. <laughs> You're not gonna see shit. You gotta live up to the hype. Cody's the kid that... Goes in the hot tub with a shirt on. <laughs> oh, I pushed the wrong floor on accident. Oh, you fucker. 
So we couldn't get this thing open and I pulled it up and I think I broke it. The outlet. Yeah, this is like about to fall off. Fuck it. Cannonball! <laughs> what up? <laughs> Damn, bro. You got bigger titties than my girl. <laughs> I got a bigger dick than you do. That hey. should be the fucking thumbnail, his tits. Be like, ooh. Just push them together. Yeah, be like, this girl has the best tits in the world. <laughs> this is my thumbnail, Cody. Damn, Cody rocking them titties. Hey. <laughs> Alright, do, do the cannonball. Oh my god! Oh, holy shit! Dude, oh my god, that was huge! That fucking hurt my ass, bro! <laughs> Did you land on the concrete? Dude, I didn't realize this was only like fucking two It's feet three feet! feet. <laughs> oh, shit. Is it warm? Yeah, it's hot. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. So I'm making eggs right now to eat. I'm gonna make two eggs before I go to the gym. But Cody and Russell are gonna swallow an egg. Well, basically <laughs> drink an egg. You're making it sound like really <laughs> swallow sick. a full egg. No, I'm kidding. They're gonna drink the yolk. I've never done this before. Literally, so. just gulp it down. Like, don't I'm, act like I'm putting the whole thing in my mouth. Just swallow mouth straight swallow away. Swallow the whole thing. All right, no, I'm gonna put it in my mouth and sit there and fucking chew on it so the yolk breaks open in my mouth. There you I'm go. Chew all over the place. <laughs> hey. <laughs> He's ready. Do it at the same time. Here, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna we're gonna cheers and now we're gonna no. <laughs> yeah. Go. Ready? Was that bad or no? Not really. He doesn't it like tastes, it. It tastes like <laughs> shit. Really weird. Yeah. It, it tastes, tastes like it tastes wait, pretty bad. It but. tastes like fucking shit. <laughs> I just like slurped that down. I do. I just swallowed the whole I feel, Yeah, I feel like it's I just like, like slid like yeah, I, yes. I left my throat open and just like let it slide down. <laughs> like I do Lance's dick. <laughs> <laughs> so the reason I'm making eggs before I go to the gym is because I haven't eaten in a couple of hours, but I don't feel like eating too much food that it's going to make me not feel like I want to lift. So I'm going to eat a small portion of something like eggs, for example, and then I'm going to take a little bit of pre-workout and then hit the gym. So I just ate those eggs to give me a little bit of energy and so I don't feel like shit. And now I'm going to head to the gym. How to be a douchebag 101 just wear a shirt that reads this I'm only wearing it because I think it's funny and plus it's a tank top so I'll just throw it off at the gym oh my god Russell open the fuck up oh shit this house caught on fire from the hoverboard bounce that shit <laughs> Cheesecake. So this is a Don. He's got a breathing mask on right now. Tell him what it does. Well, you gotta take it off first. <laughs> Kids don't try this at home. That's all I gotta say. Yeah, right. Basically, it helps him breathe as if he's in like a different environment. Basically, it's like adjusting your lungs, and when you take it off, you feel a lot better with your breathing, right? A lot better, yeah. So it, this one goes up to like twenty-five thousand elevation. Damn. So. Good challenge. It's a heavy breathing. And heavy then breathing, but don't do it like right away. You know, kind of gradually, you know, do it a little bit more. Yeah, yeah. But it's good. Like but as it. soon as you it's basically like your body's adapting to it, then once you do it more often, it's gonna be easier and easier Easy. to breathe. Oh yeah. And so, then probably when you're running, it's so you're much running, easier. It's a lot easier when you're working out, it's a lot easier, you feel stronger. Yeah. Different benefits. Just it. your breathing overall gets better, right? Yeah. That's dope. Singer, you know what I'm saying? Hey. <laughs> hey. Get it, Cody. Guys. Cody's gonna lose so much weight. We just gotta keep it motivated. Yo, if in like a year from now, dude, if you just work out every single day and run and shit, you'll be so much better looking. That's the goal. 30 minutes of laps, bro. Distance 9.5 miles. Let's go. Keep working. 400 calories burned. Damn, bro, you just fucking burned off a double cheeseburger at McDonald's. Let's go. <laughs> 10.3 miles, boy. 430 calories burned. Good shit. So me and Cody are gonna go for a little jog real quick. Cody destroyed this bike. He broke the fucking front. The grip's falling off. First off, it's not, not a bike. bike. It's second off. It's a scooter. The front's destroyed because you made me do it. <laughs> true, true. Just got done lifting. Uh, Cody wanted to go over to this thing called Body Energy Club so you can get, what is it, like a press juice or something? Yeah. The one who wants to lose the most weight is on a fucking scooter right now. <laughs> I wish I didn't bring this because I really feel like walking right yeah. now. Yeah. You can ride it if you want. I'm down. This thing is my scooter and Cody literally rides this shit ten times more than I do. The store is loaded uh, with just supplements. Um, A lot of shit. And then I got some meals over here, like prepared meals. 
But Cody is thinking about making a vlogging channel so you guys can see him on the days that he's not in my vlogs. And uh, he might go out and buy a camera tomorrow. So if he does make a vlog and does post it, I will give him a little shout out and you guys can go check it out and see how it is. But uh, he's debating on if he wants to do it or not right now. So Cody and Russell just left and I am extremely tired right now. But I know that I have to edit this vlog and I will not pass out tonight without editing it. And hopefully fully because the past couple of nights I've been like starting to edit it and then I just end up passing out. Here's the thing, I love doing vlogs. I think it's so cool. I, I love it with a passion. The only thing that sucks about it is I usually edit everything at night, but it's around the time where I feel so tired that I feel like I'm just gonna pass out. So if I just feel like chilling at night or just going to sleep early, it's almost never possible because I have to go and edit the vlog from that day. But I'm not complaining because I really like doing this stuff and it's really cool and interesting to me. But let me get to editing that vlog. And if anybody tried to purchase a shirt, I don't know if you're going to be able to purchase a shirt as this vlog goes up. You might have like a couple hours to purchase it. But the shirts are pretty much done being sold by now. You guys can go on the website and check if it's still available, but I don't think it's going to be available. But that pretty much wraps everything up. If you guys haven't turned on my post notifications already, make sure to do so so you never miss a vlog. And I will see you guys next time. Graham, why you fight with me at Cheesecake? You, you know I like to go there. Go where? You say I'm acting light skin. You think there's something wrong with you? <laughs>